Hello friends, welcome to Yochi. I'm Marissa and I'm pleased to guide you through the six healing sounds. One of the greatest contributions of traditional Chinese medicine is understanding how our emotions affect our health. We intuitively know that stress, anger, worry, sadness, and fear don't feel good. And this is science. Fear-based emotions stimulate the release of toxic chemicals, while love-based emotions stimulate the release of healing chemicals. Qigong views the world in the language of energy, and emotions are energy. They are a frequency that is stored and recorded in your energy field. So negative fear-based frequencies attract negative energy, while positive frequencies attract positive energy. Thousands of years ago, the ancient healers looked to nature and they saw that humans and animals make specific sounds to release emotions in different situations. They discovered that the vibration of certain sounds resonates with certain organs in the body. So we can use the sound to clear organs of negative emotions, like clearing worry from the spleen, anger from the liver, fear from the kidneys, and sadness from the lungs. So the Six Healing Sounds is designed to transform negative emotions into positive virtues. The Six Healing Sounds dates back to the 4th century AD. It is recorded in the Record of Longevity and Nourishing Life by Dao Hong. Now today, there are many different interpretations and applications of the sounds. The method that we will be using today incorporates specific postures with breath, intention, sound, and light. The sound vibration is used to clear negative energy from the organ. This is purging, while the light brings positive, virtuous energy into the organs. This is tonifying. So the Six Healing Sounds is a purging and tonifying practice. It is a healing meditation. Before we get started, let's review the Six Healing Sounds and their correspondences. The Six Healing Sounds correspond to the five yin organs and the triple warmer. The first organ is the lungs because this is the organ of release and letting go. The lungs are affected by sadness and grief. Their virtue is courage and righteousness, and the colored light is white. The sound for the lungs is like you're gonna say snake. The next organ is the kidneys. The kidneys are affected by fear and shock. Their virtue is peace and tranquility and the color is blue light. The kidney sound is The sound is like rushing water or blowing out a candle. You can try with me now. Next is the liver. The liver is affected by anger and stress. The positive virtue of the liver is kindness and generosity. So when we use the sound, we can transform stress into kindness and relaxation. The colored light for the liver is emerald green light, and the sound is shh, just like you're hushing or calming a baby. The next sound is the heart sound. The heart is the emperor of all the emotions and is affected by hatred. Its virtue is love. So when we use the sound, we can transform impatience, hatred, and hastiness into love and joy. The color of the heart is red light, and the sound is <sighs> Next is the spleen. The spleen carries the frequency of worry and doubt. When we use the sound, we can transform these frequencies into trust and sincerity. The color of the spleen is golden yellow light, and the sound is This is a guttural sound, so you feel it coming from the spleen. 
Now it's important that when you make the sounds that they are not just a vibration from your mouth, they're also an extension of the lungs and vibrate in the organs. The last sound is the triple warmer. This is a special meridian in traditional Chinese medicine that is very important to regulate your endocrine system and to balance the energy in your body. The color is purple light and the sound is The six healing sounds can be done any time of day, every day. It's great to use as a purging method before other Qigong practices, and it's recommended to use before bed. This will help clear out any accumulated energy that you may have taken on throughout the day and help to promote a good night's sleep. So are you ready to tap into your inner light? Find a comfortable spot, preferably on a chair, and join me. Let's move some qi.